Kyrie Jamaluddin, the coordinating minister for the National COVID-19 Immunization Program, admitted that while herd immunity may no longer be a useful yardstick against which to measure the program's success, 80% had long been the benchmark set by the government. With the government ramping up the national vaccination rate as vaccine supplies increased, Kyrie had been announcing projections as to when each state would reach the coveted figure. He said the government was aiming to fully vaccinate 26 million people by December. The vaccination rate is used as a key indicator that will dictate when Malaysia will be able to move through the different phases of the national recovery plan, culminating in the full reopening of the economy and the return of domestic tourism. At a recent talk hosted by the Oxford and Cambridge Society Malaysia, Kyrie said he had been given specific instructions to begin expediting vaccinations as early as possible. I was instructed by the cabinet and the prime minister to accelerate the vaccination exercise, he said. That means, rather than phasing things out and leaving things until December, we are trying to achieve the target as quickly as possible. What happens after the country reached the 80% mark has yet to be revealed, but it would mark a key turning point in the country's long and protracted battle with the COVID-19 virus.